Hi and welcome. Today we're going to talk about the Spagyric Method. So what is the Spagyric Method for you guys who don't know? Spagyric comes from alchemy, or is a something in alchemy. So alchemy is a grand philosophy that has been through us throughout the ages. It's been here for many thousands of years and it started all in Egypt. From Egypt it went down into Greece and so forth and then became modern science. So, spagyrix is a two combined word. So, spa and jiric. So, spa means to separate and jiric means to combine. So, what do you want to do with spagyrix in alchemy? So, you want to do a transmutation. Transmutation is basically to take one substance and convert it into another. So, in alchemy, the most famous one was trying to make lead into gold. In alchemy, it's more than just making lead into gold. It's making inner alchemy and it's making outer alchemy. You make, make alchemy from metals, from plants, humans, animals and so on. You can make spagyrics from anything in nature because everything follows the same three principles. So what we do is like we try to distill down everything to its three main basic principles. So in alchemical language, you have a lot of symbolism. So you talk about symbolic languages to try to represent all these kinds of different principles. So in this spagyric way, we have the three principles of soul, mind and body. So what is the soul, mind and body? The soul is the essential oils of a plant, for example. The mind is the fermentation of the plant, which produces alcohol. So the mind is alcohol, the essential oils is the soul, and the body is the alkaline salts, which is locked up in the fibers of the plant. To release these alkaline salts, you need to burn the plant through a process called calcination. So what do we do? We try to separate these principles of a plant, for example, hemp. So the first thing we do in our production is that we take the plant material, we run it through a socket extraction system in a closed loop in a vacuum. We get out the essential oils and then we get a really thick paste. From this paste, we can just take it out, leave it be, and then we can take alcohol, add it into a new reaction, but then we need to have the salts of the plant. So the salt and mineral crystals is locked up in the fibers of the plant. We take the fibers of the plant that is depleted in our production, take it out, burn it in a very, very, very hot temperature, and you burn it until you can't burn it anymore, and then you purified this plant material into a grey ash. From the grey ash, you can take distilled water and pull out the water-soluble salt and mineral crystals. These salt and mineral crystals are the body of the plant. You combine that with the mine, which is alcohol, and the essential oils, which is the, the black paste that you get out of the extraction. All these three combined will go into a new reaction in a vacuum, and they will start to react really heavily comprised of new compounds, things will start to fuse together and also it becomes much more water soluble. So what you did is that you transmutated the plant from one version into a higher version. You basically raised the vibration and the potency of the plant. It becomes a much more holistic type of product that incorporates everything of the plant in a much more potent and purified way. So in the end it will be much more bioavailable for the body. It will have a lot more different compounds and a lot more fusings of different compounds that science doesn't really, really understand at this point. We believe that this spagyric oil that we make is one of the most truly unique products available on the market.